Hi everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we are here in Newport Beach, California. It's an absolute spectacular day outside and Marina and I love the water so we decided to head on down and cruise around the coast. But probably not in the way you're thinking. We ended up actually renting an electric duffy boat and we're going to take you on a very scenic cruise around the Newport Harbor on this episode of The Walker Chronicles. We're renting the Duffy boat from Newport Fun Tours on PCH. They rent boats and other water toys seven days of the week. They have a couple different sized boats to accommodate groups of up to 14 passengers. It's a 90 minute rental and the cost varies but averages around $180. Weekdays are less expensive and discounts can be found on sites like Living Social and Groupon. If you got pets, they're welcome on board as well. They will also provide a Bluetooth speaker for music if available. Some of the boats actually just have built-in radios. You can bring food and drinks on the boat, including alcoholic beverages. However, the captain of the boat cannot be under the influence. If you forgot to bring any food, don't worry. They actually have vending machines on site. Return time is really important. They allow you a five minute grace period, but after that you're charged $1.50 for every minute that you're late. All of this and more is listed on their website and we'll link it down below. Watch your step and watch your head. Okay, excellent. On the right side, right over there, that's going to be your throttle. Push yep. that forward to go forward, back yep. towards you to go in reverse, and then it drives yep. like a car. Safety wise, fire extinguishers in the front cubby, along with adult life jackets, more adult life jackets underneath all the seats, okay. uh, but mostly in the front right there. All right. There's also a built in horn right over here. If you can okay. give that a, oh, my bad, right here. If you can give that a quick press upward, and that's for emergency purposes only. Okay. And there's also a built-in stereo right here, just in case you didn't bring your own. And then are you familiar with the harbor at all? So there's gonna be a QR code right over here you can scan. It's gonna give you the best view of where we're currently at. Okay. And then for a total of 90 minutes, you're gonna be following that blue line right there. Brings you right back to us in 90 minutes. Come back to this dock, but way off in the water, about a basketball court in length away. Basically about midway between the yellow buoy out there and, and this here. dock. And just hang uh, out there. And then yeah, and then we'll wave at you and we'll let you know which side to go okay. to. Okay. Thanks. Thank you. Oh, there we go. Pulling away from the dock. <laughs> I'm a boat captain. <laughs> <laughs> you are a boat captain. Joining in the ride are some paddle boarders. She's a bit away from us, uh, I'm zooming in a little bit, but here in the harbor you'll see paddle boarders, kayakers, we've seen seals going along with us. It's just a beautiful, beautiful bay and harbor. Well, that's one way to paddle board is just sit down. I think I could handle that without getting into too much trouble. And you get to wear a life vest, so just gives you a little bit more confidence. Uh-oh. His oar broke. <laughs> Not sure how you fix that when you're out here on the water, but I'm sure he'll manage. He looks like he's done this before. So this blue boat right here, we were following them. They took off ahead of us and they've kind of, I don't know, I don't think they're following the map at all. They veer to the left, they veer to the right, and now at the fork, they've gone left. And you're not supposed to do that. According to the map, you're supposed to go to the right, which is right this way. So we're gonna follow the map that they've given us on the QR code and uh, obey the rules that they've given us. 
And here you get some really close ups of some of the boats and yachts that are out here. Wow, these are some giants. Get this Alessa Lay, that's gorgeous. Some power from this boat, my goodness, four motors, wow, that's crazy. Talk about California dreaming. Uh, who knows, Chris? One day, right? One day. <laughs> it, it's not today, but one day. <laughs> All right, Captain Chris, we are encountering other boats and paddleboarders and kayakers. How comfortable on a scale from one to 10 do you feel out here? About a, about a seven, a solid seven. <laughs> the beach here is really active. See lots of folks with their canopies, their little tents. Lots of families out here having a great time on the water. Just like we are, only uh, we're in a boat. It's like there is a paddleboard class going on out here. Hi guys! <laughs> yeah, maybe I'll need to give that a try because uh, I'm not so confident on a paddleboard. Haven't tried it, but my balance is not all that great. All right, so once you check in, they give you back your receipt and your paper. So they give you this tiny little yellow uh, card here. And this little card is basically your emergency card. It's got a phone number on it in case you get lost or your boat dies. <laughs> so it's the equivalent of almost like a 911 for, oh my God, my boat doesn't work. Oh, I'm lost, I'm about to run into a tour boat or something. It's so. your AAA card. Exactly. So. That's nice, don't lose it, it's very tiny. So here are some of the mechanics of the boat. So I'm sitting here next to Chris, you'll see the steering wheel. And uh, he made mention about this battery or I guess- a meter that kind of tells you the battery level because all these boats are actually electric. And you can see it's got the green where it says 100% and then 50% and 25%. But when you get into the red, there's no percentage. It actually just says, oh, I guess that means you uh, better start using that little yellow ticket I just pulled out and start <laughs> calling for help. <laughs> so, Because you're in trouble, man. you're in trouble. We also have some little sailing boats. Here's NHYC Sailing. These are young kids here out on the water. They're with the Balboa Yacht Club. How cute is this? My gosh. Being out here on the water, these kids look like they must be under 10. So much fun. And they're right along with these kind of boats, our Duffy boats. And you'll see some larger boats that are parked in the harbor. So they have to navigate all of that with the wind. There's no engines on those boats. It's very weird. You turn wheel and nothing happens but then about three seconds later it happens <laughs> yeah this is nothing like driving a car if you turn the wheel it takes a while for the boat to actually I mean it's fighting against the current in the water so you need to make sure that you're planning where you're going and uh, making sure you make those turns and stops a few seconds before you actually have to make the turn. Yeah. And there are no brakes. There are no brakes, yes. There is a reverse. <laughs> but if you want to stop, you better stop very, very early by uh, reversing the engine. Here up in the front of the boat, you probably notice this wooden piece. It has a little bit of a channel in it. Um, also has a couple of leaves on the side. It's a table, so you can put your drinks and your food on. It has a second side also let's pop that up there we go so let's uh let's put some food on here we brought some chips cheese crackers things like that so here we have all of our snacks for our 90 minute tour we didn't bring all that many uh, 90 minutes is at least for us not a lot of time to really <laughs> to get in and have you know a full-on uh, like meal fried chicken and potato salad that kind of thing um, our snacks are pretty simple. Chips, salsa, some crackers and cheese. And here you'll also see the Welcome to Balboa sign. This is Funland. 
There's a Ferris wheel, some little carnival stuff going on, which is always for a good time. And the fact that it's off the beach and off the water, it just makes it a perfect, perfect day. Wow, some of these houses just make my jaw drop. Not only do they look beautiful, the surroundings that they're at are beautiful. I'm home. Look at this house, my gosh. And there's a slip right here in front of their house. I can't even imagine what kind of a, a boat, if this is theirs, what it looks like. Amazing. <laughs> I never feel small, but I feel very small right now. So we've come to the halfway point. We did uh, make a turn, so we are headed back on in to the dock area. And you'll see PCH is right up there. Here, in case you didn't know, uh, is kind of a, a very famous house, or the person who lived here was very famous. Um, we know him as uh, Marion Wayne, or also known as uh, John Wayne, in case you're wondering. His house is right here. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous property. Look at this! Cruising Tiki's Newport.com. It is a tiki bar out on the water. This is too much fun. How cute is that? So here's the property. Here's John Wayne's property. Uh, I'm not sure if the family estate still owns this. But uh, yeah, it is gorgeous. And we have seen the boat that parks, or the yacht, I should say, that parks in this slip. And it is enormous. And it's gorgeous. Uh, yeah. Wonder where it is today. Probably out on the water, if I'm guessing. Um, or, or having the barnacle scraped off of it. But beautiful, beautiful property right here on the Newport coast. So far this has been incredibly relaxing. There's some moments of tenseness though, I have to admit, <laughs> and you get a whole bunch of traffic around you because I'm just not super familiar with uh, driving a boat. And I think this is probably the simplest form of boat you can actually uh, operate. But it's still very nice. It's beautiful outside. You're looking at all these wonderful things. I have amazing company <laughs> and some great little snacks. So I don't think today can get much better actually. Of course, I could win fifteen thousand dollars playing some slot machine, but it's <laughs> Next not a bad time. day. Next time. Yeah, we'll just cruise over to Catalina to the casino. <laughs> and yes, I know it's not that type of casino. Oh, this is wonderful! Oh, turbulence. Here's another Duffy Boat rental place. So you'll see, it was really easy for them to just kind of park their boat, drift on in slowly, and uh, they pull you into the dock, and that's the end of your ride. So we'll be doing that. Uh, we'll be ending our tour here shortly. I don't think we have much more time. I think maybe another 15 minutes or so. Uh oh, uh oh, 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 oh. Oh my goodness. That was not good. You might want to slow down, Chris, yeah. Might want to slow down. That was close for these folks here. Not sure who was driving, but uh, yeah, that, that was close. So we are back. So as instructed, we need to just pull off here into the harbor a little bit 
and hang out and they will call us and wave us in. So we're gonna do just that. Here you'll see the Newport Beach brew boat. I can't really see their feet, but I do see a paddle on the very end. And I'm guessing that if I was to take a closer look at where their feet are, there would be some pedals. So they, it's a man powered boat, I'm guessing, but maybe as we get closer and we park this boat in, we'll take a look. Brew boat is coming out. I can see their feet and everyone is slowly pedaling their way. <laughs> That's fun. <laughs> and I can you from here. You can leave it in neutral now. Okay. Hey, do you don't need to throw anything away. There's bins on the way up. The bathroom's gonna be up the same ramp you came down. Just make a left around the corner of the building. Okay. And okay. there's no checking up till they get together. Excellent. Wow. Thank you. I am officially a captain of a boat. <laughs> Thank you. Take care. 